What is geostrophic wind explained simply? If you've ever wondered how winds form and why they blow in certain directions, you're about to uncover a key part of the answer. Let's talk about geostrophic wind. Geostrophic wind is a type of wind that occurs high up in the Earth's atmosphere, typically above a kilometer from the surface. It's the result of two main forces, the pressure gradient force and the Coriolis effect. First, let's look at the pressure gradient force. This force arises because air moves from areas of high pressure to areas of low pressure. Imagine air as water flowing down a hill. It moves from the top, where the pressure is higher, to the bottom, where the pressure is lower. The tighter the spacing between these high and low pressure areas, or isobars, the stronger this force is, and the faster the wind will blow. Now, let's add in the Coriolis effect. This is due to the Earth's rotation. In the Northern Hemisphere, the Coriolis effect deflects moving air to the right, while in the Southern Hemisphere, it deflects it to the left. This deflection is stronger near the poles and weaker near the equator. When these two forces balance each other out, you get geostrophic wind. This wind blows parallel to the isobars, which are lines of equal pressure. So if you stand with your back to the wind, the low pressure will be on your left in the Northern Hemisphere and on your right in the Southern Hemisphere. Here's a simple way to visualize it. Imagine air moving from a high pressure area to a low pressure area. As it moves, the Coriolis effect starts to deflect it. This deflection continues until the Coriolis force equals the pressure gradient force, at which point the wind starts blowing parallel to the isobars. Geostrophic winds are faster where isobars are packed closer together because the pressure gradient force is stronger in these areas. They are also more common near the poles, where the Coriolis effect is stronger. In real-world conditions, friction from the ground can affect these winds, making them slightly different from the ideal geostrophic wind. However, over oceans where friction is less, geostrophic winds align more closely with actual wind patterns. So, to sum it up, geostrophic wind is the wind that results from the balance between the pressure gradient force and the Coriolis effect blowing parallel to isobars high up in the atmosphere. This balance is what makes geostrophic winds a fundamental concept in understanding how our atmosphere works.